Pokemon here, playing the Retro Free. Okay, I just keep going down here to the book and the flower. The war on Drake. Clear on Long as the black ones are chasing gorillas. So, how do you go with this either? I was having a bit out minding my own business when suddenly puppy pops and heels went. Stop scaring us, decent folk. already. Come on, let's find some arse rests. Should start soon. Dream of rain. 
raven locks and twisted stormy of violet eyes glistening as you Samarian boys back in White Orchard. Silence, woman. We've come to hear music. A murderer? There's a war on. Some die. Oh, please, argue this out elsewhere. Squabbles and rows again. And I was told this was a decent establishment. If I know Geralt, he risked his noggin to save someone else's ass. Save, you say? He murdered folk. Don't let him provoke you. There's the door. Settle this outside. Come. I wish to listen to music. Music! Cultural capital of the world? The fuck it is? It permits me uh, to introduce... Uh, uh, this year's the summer. Known also as Kalanetta. Huh. As lovely as she is talented. And this. It's Geralt of Rivia, I know. Dandelion's told me a great deal about you, and I've listened with bated breath. Don't be surprised. After all, doubt I could think of a more fitting subject for a ballad than a witch's love for a sorceress. Or should I say, sorceresses. Seems Dandelion was meticulous in telling my story down to personal and insignificant details. Did he offer anything about himself, like where he was going? <laughs> Splendid. Very funny, truly. So, see you later. Not here. Come with me. There a reason for all this sneaking around? An excellent one. When last I saw Dandelion, he told me he was planning a heist. Siggy Reuben's vault? Shoot up. And I've not seen him since. Dandelion breaking into a vault. I'd sooner expect him to choose a life of celibacy. True. I got to pay for his way into Passaflora once. I need to wake the next three nights worrying about it. Any idea what got into him? He have debts he needed to pay off? Claimed he was helping someone. Urgent matter that couldn't wait, he said. This someone, Dandelion mentioned their name? No. But if I know Dandelion, it's her name he failed to mention. As he failed to mention her slender waist and ample bosom. Reuven. What's he like? Tall, fat, dangerous as hell. Limp in his gait. Left leg. Sounds like a lame rock troll. If trolls were devilishly intelligent and had a flair for crime, yeah, I'd agree. Let me guess. Attempted heist was a failure. Well, he's not driven up in a gilded carriage laden with jewels, so I should think so. I've asked after him everywhere, but it seems an army of tongue-stealing cats has overrun the city. I learned only that he raised a ruckus at Horson Jr.'s lair. Then Horson's men chased him all over town. Horson Jr. doesn't ring a bell. Biggest prick in Novigrad. Not literally, but... Got it. You're not a fan. But what did he do to you? Try the whole town. He's one of four bosses who control the city's underworld. The others being Siggy Reuven, Carlo the Cleaver Vares, and the King of Beggars. The rascal. At least they didn't cross the church as well. Bring that venerable institution into it. We'd be in deep then. Here I go again, rushing to Dandelion's rescue. He ought to pay me a 
salary. Whoever he is, I sincerely doubt he's in the mood for jokes. Nor am I, in fact. Relax. I'll get him out of this. Gotta talk to this Horson first. And Siggy Reuven. Know where I might find them? I don't know about Horson, but Reuven runs a bathhouse. Careful, though. He's a dangerous character. So am I. I don't doubt it. But Dandelion's not. I beg you to hurry. Let me know as soon as you learn anything. Anybody there? Open up. What's the fuss? The bathhouse is closed. Need to talk to the owner. I know he's here. I'm not sure that matters, as he's terribly busy. Busy? With what? Entertaining important guests. In that case, tell him there's another one at the door. Geralt of Rivia. And I'm not leaving till I see him. <laughs> Very well, I shall try. Please wait. Ruven cordially invites you to join him. I'm happy. The meeting is in the baths. We will pass through the dressing room so you can leave your clothes. Let's go. You made this robe here. Your equipment will be safe. Son Junior is a dead man. I'll have my scribe send you a notice. You don't have a scribe. And we'll eliminate Junior when, and only when, all of us say I. Reuven, your guest. Why the fuck you let him in here? Because I want to talk to him. This is Geralt of Rivia. Good to see you again. 
As always, I'm out of the swiving loop. Who the fuck are you? Think I'll let your host introduce me. He's a witcher. The very one who first foiled an attempt on Foltest life, and then killed that what? What? Allegedly. But I didn't kill Foltest. And hello to you too, Dijkstra, Ruven. Whatever they call you these days. Last we met, Geralt thrashed me silly and crushed my ankle. I really wonder what he's got in store this time. Got intruders. Someone just snuck inside the bathhouse. Several men. What the fuck's he on about? Plowing fortune teller. Assassins! Please, no! Ah! Bloody hell. I fucking knew it. Any weapons tucked away? Just a few. Sorry for that incident. My security failed. I'll get to the bottom of who, why, and how. They were whoresome scum. That's the bottom of who and how right there. Don't start that again. Especially not in front of our guests. Who pranced in right before they attacked? Coincidence? Why do I doubt it? Let's give him a chance to explain. Going back here again. Not gonna introduce me to your friends. Good thing happens not here. He tanned the hide on my ass for being so rude. Francis Bedlam, you know, but then who's not heard of this patron of the fine arts and supporter of entrepreneurs of limited initial means? <coughs> and the dwarfs Carlo Vares, known also as Cleaver. Carlo's in entertainment, mostly. 
I'm looking for Horson Jr. Interesting. What do you want with him? Junior is gonna help me find someone. Orson's not helped a soul in all his miserable life. I'll ask him nicely. See, Cleaver? Perhaps if you'd not called Junior an uncle fucker and asked him nicely, he'd have showed up today. Gentlemen, you out of your fucking minds? A chat session? Poor son's out to get us, and he'll succeed eventually. We've got to kill him first. So by all means, you sit here, soak, fart, and watch the bubbles rise, while I send my boys to Whore Son's hidey holes. They'll make some noise, flush the bugger out. And you, geriatric, or whatever your plowing name is, want to find Whore Son? Find me first. I need to find Horson. Now it looks like I gotta get to him before Cleaver does. Cleaver won't find him easy. Junior's good at hiding. He's got peasant smarts. Look at the time. Good luck in your search, Witcher. I'll call on you tomorrow, Francis. We'll finish our chat. So how about we get dressed? Sure, sure. Then we'll talk. In private. Right mess that was. Never thought I'd be glad to see the man responsible for my taking frequent baths. If you're any cleaner for it, gotta say it was worth breaking your ankle. It healed poorly. Can you believe it? I must soak it in hot water at least six times a day now. Failing that, it bloody pounds like the bells of Beauclair at dawn. Sorry to hear that. You're sorry? Well, consider it resolved, then. Now, mind showing some added compassion could mean a miraculous recovery to me. Listen, Reuven. No, Dijkstra. Just not in the mood for your code names, passwords, and other bullshit. I'm here on specific business. If you want to listen, listen. If not, I'd rather you spared me your wit and threw me out now. Ah, uh, what's the harm? Talk. You think Cleaver will find Orson? He might. He might not, but he'll burn down half the city trying. What waste. Leave him to it, I say. Work alone. Any ideas? Junior's got areas of the city where he's strong. Penetrate them, look around. But be discreet. None of this speed and fury and swinging your steel cock about. Hmm. Makes sense to ask around, I guess. Junior might be in hiding, but he's got to be collecting income. Couldn't afford to cut himself off. Gambling. That's his big earner. Junior controls the largest casino in town. I'll never forget. Hierarch Hemelfart raised all kinds of hallowed hell there once. Bugger bet lost his ruby ring. Then there's the arena in the city's bowels. Betting scheme generates near as much as the casino. They're always looking for hired muscle there. Suppose you could always search Horson's house. Though I doubt you'll find him there. Maybe some clue, though. Horson's got net. Arena sound. Sue has been it. Mentioned Horson. Solid town at. See if I can't find Horson at the casino or the arena. Might talk to Cleaver as well, but. Do what you will. Just be. Thanks for your. Just go. And if you can't find the slimy bastard, come and see me. I know him well. Might think.
Listen, Dandelion's missing, and it's Same thing that happens to anyone who's... Meaning? He's surrounded by split... Come, Geralt, what do you think's happened? Loot. Far as I'm concerned. You wouldn't happen to have a bone to pick with Dandelion, would you? Of course I do. Are you serious? Dead serious. Dandelion published a sonnet recently. Second stanza, the shit uses paired couplets instead of an inserted rhyme. Surely you understand how deeply offended the poetry lover in me was. A bastard shan't get away with it. I was being serious. As am I when I say I have problems. You might be able to. And if you did, why then I might be inclined to ask after Dandelion, establish what happened to him. Maybe I can help. What do you need? I'd rather show than tell. Figured as much. Excellent.